My name's Roger McGough and uh, I'm here at LJMU, Liverpool John Moores University, as you see in the workshop where we've been making these uh, wonderful doors. As a project that came about when uh, David Fleming from the museum, New Museum of Liverpool, invited me to put some poems into the new museum. And then I was in a pub. I've never ever gone to pubs, but I found myself in a pub with a friend of mine called Mark Cockrum. Hi, my name is Mark Cockrum. I'm a designer, bookbinder and artist, and I'm working with Roger on the Liverpool Doors project. Over a couple of pints of beer in our local, we eventually came up with the idea of using a big book. Well, how big could we make the book? And after maybe a sherry or two, we decided that we could make them as big as a door. And then I realised that in the history of the book, the diptych, monotych, polytych, triptychs from the Romano British period, for example, were made from wood. And doors are made from wood. So it seems a very logical step to me. So hence, a bookbinder working with doors, working with a poet. And I decided then to not only have my poems in the exhibition, but the poems from people of Liverpool. I'm Linda Jones and I am a History of Art and Museum student and um, I got involved with the project because I was interested in the concept of um, an artist working with um, a poet within the museum space. I've uh, been involved with the Fine Art Group and um, we've been assigned about three or four doors which we were asked to paint. Hi, I'm Kyla Barkley and I study graphic arts at JMU. Working with Roger and Mark was great. Um, basically, they put their input in and we put our input in, which seems to work quite well, really, because you get all kind of ranges of skills. The idea of this Liverpool Doors was not only to use the doors as pages for poems of mine, but also to restore some of the doors of Liverpool that had memories for me. This is my favourite door because it's Arthur Dooley's door from his studio. This is um, a door that me and my group did and it's the Everyman Bistro door, so it's taken from the Everyman Theatre. The majority of the work that we've done on the doors, it's handwritten. So in a way these are unique manuscripts, never to be repeated. They are unique objects in their own right. And that's very, very special. Yeah, I'm pleased to be working on this with Roger and the students and everybody. It's been great fun. I rather hope it might appeal to people, in, uh, particularly in Liverpool. A uh, lot of jokes and, and funny things to remember, hopefully. Um, hope they come in uh, inquisitive and go away with a smile on their face. Knock, knock. <laughs>